guys, welcome to another crafty and DIY with me, Nora, tutorial. Real quick, uh, you know, I'm, I'm trying to step up my game when it comes to doing these videos on a timely manner. So, these are the baskets, the, the plants in this basket that you get from Dollar Tree. And I'm giving them a coat of Craft Smart um, Pink Chiffon paint. I'm hoping, well, I do have enough, but it's going to take about three coats. I'm not worrying about this part here because this is going to be covered with lace or, or ribbon, whatever I have. There. Remember, these are stuff I have here. Nothing is bought. I've, I've bought so much throughout the years that I don't need to go out and buy nothing. I just choose to. <laughs> Again, painting it. This is going to take about three coats to adhere to this tin bucket. I had this around it. I took it off. Don't throw it out. Put it away. Never throw anything out. So, I'll be back when I finish painting it completely. Coats. I decided to put the nautical rope um around it. I was gonna I took it off. I was gonna add some ribbon, but I really like the way it looks. I don't want to give it too much pink because the top peak piece is pink. Now these are dowel wood dowels. From Dollar Tree. I painted the same color. I painted the tin can. This is a pink chiffon. Depending, this is good for a baby shower, for the centerpieces, for the table, for the main table, or for a little baby's room. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue these here. The I didn't want to use these, but this I um I had lanterns, pink lanterns. I don't know what I did with them, but see. So, so when I close it here, instead of putting it to the side, I'm gonna put it down, cause. Here is where I'm going to glue the sticks to the dowel sticks. Right here. And hold them in for a minute. Okay. These are just the cute things you can do for setups. Now, when I glue this in here, I'm going to take the back piece which has the crease here and I'm going to leave it to the side. I'm going to glue my stick inside. There's like a division right here, so I'm going to add the stick just above, underneath it. Okay, I'll be right back. I just did the hot glue gun. Um... This is something that you're not going to pick up from here. This is something you're going to pick up from here. You know? There you go. So now we're going to add a little paper ball to it. But what I'm going to do is, instead of like typical how the, balloon go, the ball goes like this, I'm gonna put it like this because I need support in gluing the cardboard to the sticks. If I do it like this, I have no support. Like this, I do. Let me show you. You're gonna take side by side, the two pieces where the clips are at to adjoin them Gonna hold them together. 
you're going to measure do one step at a time. We're going to glue the stick. This piece where I glued it. Hold it for a minute. And we're gonna add more glue to give it more of a support, and I'll show you how. Let me hold on to this a couple of more seconds. seconds you see you can put a teddy bear in the middle you can add like a metallic pink tissue paper so to speak I think I have some I don't think I got metallic pink but I'll see but you can also add tissue paper inside okay this one now let's do this one make sure that it's full even. And so it's important to hold on to it until it completely glue. Inexpensive too. You know how much if you go to a party store, how much they charge you for this? It's about twenty-five to thirty dollars. And all you did it for was one, two, let's put about two twenty-five. Okay. I'm gonna sit here this one. One more time. Let's let it go from here. Try not to go against the tissue paper. Flatten it down and just hold on to it. And let me tell you something real quick. Anytime you're gonna go set up for a party, a table, make sure you bring your glue gun, scissors, every all the essential just in case something goes wrong. I'll be right back. So 
Okay, so I'm just gonna give it a little more secure. Feel to it and put a little bit more. Oh, oh, getting burnt. Let's hold on to these flaps right here. Again, you can use the lanterns from Dollar Tree. Uh, I know I have some here, and I was looking for them like crazy, but I couldn't find them. So I said I could add these. I really wanted to use the lanterns because I could decorate the lanterns. Here, I'm going to see what I can put in between here and see how that goes. See? How freaking cute. Now I'm going to look for something. I forgot to tell you I painted a little bit in the inside. Because sometimes it, whatever you're going to put is going to show the silver part. I'm going to see what I have there to decor. I'll be right back. Okay, people. What I had to do is um, add a little bit more of the hot glue in the on um, this side of the stick because I didn't realize when I was pushing it to the inside a little in I moved it but oh you could use e6000 but after the top part is pieced then you reassess you make sure all the glue because this is very light um it's not like you're gonna pick it up from here you pick it up from here, you know? And even still, look, it's still sturdy. So again, I added more. This is not gonna show, it looks kinda ugly, but that's, don't even worry about that. That's not gonna show. That's just making sure that it's secure. Okay, let me see what I got in there to decor. Okay, I did some little ribbons, nothing fancy. I'm not good at making ribbons. I, ribbons. I spoke about this before. I just do them. So I made these two right here with three different nautical rope, just lace and ribbon. Let's see, I'm just winging it as I go. And for these, I just wrap them around my finger so what I'm going to do is place these up here. See? So let me do that now. Let me hold on to it. You can do the back part too if you want. But I'm just doing the front. That's up to you. Oh, but I'm also gonna give you a little hold on a second. When you're going to stick to the paper ball. Try not to, you, 
Wait one second. Let me just hold on to this. I can't think and concentrate and talk at the same time. See? So what you're going to do is when you're gluing the stick to the paper ball, let the stick guide you. Wherever it falls onto, then you glue it. You don't push it in. Try not to push the sticks in just to get a certain spot. You just land the ball on the stick, and wherever it falls, glue it from there. Try not to push nothing or push this a little bit in because at the long one, what's going to happen is it's going to detach the stick from the, the the basket, the tin basket. I think I said it right. Okay, let me just hold on to this. Let me do the next one. You know, you could do whatever you want. Don't necessarily have to be like this. Oh, 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 burnt. See? you see so far now these two I'm going to put together like this let's go let's hold this one here gonna hold them together is two pieces for each side one inside the tin basket and one outside freaking cute they charge a lot of money for these little pieces for the table you know it could be bigger it can be square. I'm going to do... I took it out, but I believe I put it back in. You see? One for here. These are the Dollar Tree wood box. I'm going to put four of these in here. You see? And it's just one here in the inside of the bucket and one at the outside of the bucket. This is the back part. You see, you, you choose to if you want to add towards the back. At the back, the ribbon and the lace. Oh, hold on. flowers that I'm going to put in the front also. You can decorate them as pretty as you want. You see? You can make them as big as you want. Get the picture frames. 
get picture frames. Get picture frames and do four. And one at the bottom. It could be as big as you want. You see how stinking cute? That's simple. Lace from the fabric store. Make your own little ribbon set, whatever. And nautical rope. Let me look for the flowers. I just want to show you real quick how it looks. And these are stuff you see, flowers. I'm looking through all my pink stuff to see what I can find to add on to it. Okay. Be right back. <laughs> 